in training. So um, the PSA um, Deadly Pharmacist Foundation course is a really, really fantastic free course to do. Every element of full scope will have a cultural competency element of it as well. So get a head start. Start thinking about studying. Um, so what's your what's your learning type? How can you increase your brain elasticity? Obviously, it's going to be incre increased a lot with masterclass in the next few days. Um, but what's your learning type? Do you like listening? Do you like reading? Do you like teaching? Um, finding out what your learning type is for you. Have a look into the um, biopsychosocial model that I discussed as well. Um, but we will be doing a masterclass forum in October for a deeper dive into that as well. So it's really an interesting one to get into. Um, and then have a look at your care clinic room standards as well. If you're thinking about upgrading, um, talk to your BDM um, or someone at Terry Wise and can help out with that as well. And essential immunisation, first aid and CPR, keep that um, up to date. Fantastic, Kate. Anything you'd like to add there, Therese, around getting started? Yeah, I totally agree. It's just looking at your, your care clinics, um, room standards. I'm just just thinking, it's a bit like when we did vaccinations. I know it took a little while, but then now that's just the standard. I can see this just being the standard, and I totally agree with like Lucy and Kate said, like, jump on board. This is the way we're heading, um, and I think they are just very rewarding. It's probably the most rewarding thing I've done in my career. I'd love to hear that, and I can tell you when you speak to vaccinations, it's not going to take 10 years of a pandemic <laughs> to get to get where we are with, that, with vaccinations for this one in particular. So, um, look, lastly, to you both, um, we've got a room full of colleagues here and a bunch more that will be watching on at home in the coming days. 